Hello everyone. Uh, welcome to the next class on process synchronization. So in the previous topics, we covered um, the basics of synchronization. We covered uh, what is synchronization. Then uh, we'd also seen um, synchronization ka kam laksa. Normally synchronization kam lagne wherever in any system that supports multiprogramming there's bound to be some errors and to handle those errors we need some kind of synchronization so we saw what multi-programming is when many job many programs are in the memory or concurrently running at the same time and we saw once many processes are concurrently running in the memory uh, they may talk to each other or they may not talk to each other if they talk to each other it's cooperative process if they may not talk to each other it's called independent process so for the ones who have missed out on the previous class please go back and look at the previous class and then come to this class so we're going to concentrate more on this cooperating processes when pro when when processes are concurrently running uh, in the system at the same time or in the memory at the same time and especially when they're cooperating especially when they're communicating with each other and they're sharing the same data then problems can arise so we saw that whenever they are sharing the same memory you know some kind of risk is there some kind of inconsistency of data is there and um, so uh, then we've seen uh, what the operating system must do in order to ha handle those uh, problems and we saw when many processes are concurrently running and they are sharing the same data then they can have race around conditions means uh, unexpected results inconsistent data suppose the data like leak data the data like read data the data like write data the process the program day then they are bound to be errors and one solution to this is if one person can when one person is using the data no other no other person can interfere if one process has access to the data no other process can interfere so that means some kind of mutual exclusion should be there that is depicted by this door and then we saw some order can be a single order of execution of processes can be synchronized using precedence graphs uh, and uh, then we had some revision in the previous class so today uh, we're going to talk about the critical section which i had touched uh, you know lightly in my previous class so what is critical section we know that problem uh, concurrent processes are talking to each other when they're not talking to each other it's fine independent processes but when they are communicating processes when concurrent processes are communicating with each with each other and they're sharing the same memory something like this if this person person one is a program process a and this is person b process b and both of them are writing the same read and writing into the same file then then it becomes a problem but um, uh, this this program a has a long list of uh, codes Program A, but there is code. So, if you code, leather your file, nay, lehi was then under there are only certain lines of code that write to this file. Your program becomes a line of code doesn't write to this file, only some one or two lines or, or one function, two functions. So, some one section of the code, one section of the code of a you know, program run by person B, one section of the code that is run by program A may require this file uh, access. So, the lay program later danger, you then reser, the lay program lay unexpected result, you then reser. Program B को पनी डल्ले program ले नहीं mm, race around condition हो दाई ना उन्हें unexpected result हो दाई ना तो तो program में सोचने section ले मतलब उन्हें सक्सा तो तो section of code that is responsible for accessing the shared data is called critical section तो तो आप कुरा यहाँ आए हो कि um, mutual exclusion को कुरा आए हो तो ये वड़ा ये वड़ा program ले ये वड़ा program ले यो यो shared data लाई चालू होता फिरी और उनको नहीं ले उन्हें disturb करने बाए ना बंदा बने को मतलब uh, in in terms of critical section is your program code two code junse code le chai yo file lai update garcha two code lai ule execute garda that that code is called critical section so when this person is in its critical section no other person can go into its critical section haina you know, your program ko pani yo yo process ko pani certain section certain program code huncha euta sana section ko code huncha jale chai yo file lai read and write garcha like critical section once so, that's why your person day or or lines are in a program or lines in a two critical section book that's a or a company critical section was an over in a 
भनम भनेको मतलब उले यो फाइल लाई लेख्दा अरु लेख्न भएन सो यो क्रिटिकल सेक्सन एन्ड म्युचुअल एक्सक्लुजन गर्न पर्यो सो दैट इज वन वन वे अफ डुइङ इट सो सो त्यो कसरी यो क्रिटिकल सेक्सन कसरी यो जुन चाहिँ कन्कुरेन्ट प्रोसेसेसहरु छ व्हिच आर कम्युनिकेटिङ विथ इच अदर कसरी चाहिँ इनहरुको क्रिटिकल सेक्सन लाई म्युचुअल एक्सक्लुजन गर्ने त दैट इज कॉल्ड योर क्रिटिकल सेक्सन प्रब्लम सो वन वे इज वी सेड इज यू कैन सिंक्रोनाइज इट दिस वे now before a person goes into his critical section if this is a code long code so if he this is the part of the code that is going to access the shared memory this critical section so before he enters this critical section he says he, he has an entry section entry section ma ke garcha ule bancha ki look more critical section ja dai chha ye bancha so he is he is going to declare that he is going inside the critical section and after he declares that he is going in the critical section some kind of um some kind of um, you know some kind of flag is raised so no other so you know, some kind of sign is there so that a process one is inside his critical section so when some other process wants to enter its critical section he looks at the sign is a hey, no process a is already in this critical section so i will not enter the critical section so person before entering critical section a process before entering critical section can have an entry section where he flags where he says that look i want to enter my critical section and ule tyo bhane pachi operating system le aur lai jana didaina So once he is inside the critical section, he finishes executing his critical section. Critical section means accessing the shared data. Then he exits the critical section. So exits means that he tells operating system or in some manner, you know, he lets everybody know that look, I am no more in the critical section. Whoever wants to go into the critical section, you can go. So how do you implement this? How do you implement the synchronization with this critical section? That is called a critical region problem. so a question all normally comes in all of the question people what do you mean by critical region problem critical region problem paneko te ho ki how are we going to address the problem of mutual exclusion in critical section euta program ko critical section ma khali ekai jana matrai hos when one program is in its critical section no other program or process can be in its critical section how do you bring or how do you give this mutual exclusion to these critical sections that is called a critical region problem so any solutions that you have you know you you've got many solutions for this critical section problem but whatever solutions that we have all must have these three qualities one is called the mutual exclusion obviously you know when one person is one process is in its critical section no other process can be in its critical section um the second is bounded weight bounded weight paniko if one process wants to enter its critical section you cannot keep him waiting forever no you cannot wait forever and progress means um if uh if process a has entered its critical section and now he's finished his critical section process a and he leaves the critical section and some other process wants to enter its critical section but process a keeps blocking them from entering the critical section Oh, in another words, when I'm trying, what I'm trying to tell you is, if one person has finished his work, then another person sh- person should get his chance. But if the first person who's finished his work does not allow for some reason, he's always interfering and not allowing the second person to come inside uh, to do his work and to enter the critical section, in spite of the first person having finished his work, then there is no progress. Uh, each one is blocking each other's work so that should not be there so whenever you are having whenever we are having a solution to solving this critical section problem that solution that algorithm that program must have mutual exclusion okay they must look at this bounded waiting matlab bounded waiting huno bhayen they must be bounded waiting means euta manche wait garne euta bound hunu paryo euta limit hunu paryo euta boundary hunu paryo forever wait gari gareko hunu bhayena so they must be bounded waiting and they must always be progress you know someone cannot block or delay someone else's time to go into the critical section so now in the next section we'll see what are the different approaches fine so uh, the different approaches there are uh, you know in a broad category there are three ways of approaching this critical section solution one is the software approach the others are the hardware approach and then you have uh, the other approaches such as um, uh, programming constructs given by the operating system so what is the software approach uh software approaches to critical section problem bane ko yo ki we are talking about what we are talking about concurrent processes we are talking about processes that are talking to each other and sharing the same data 
so there are problems inconsistent data there are race around conditions so some things must happen sections so software approaches when you key concurrent processes Julie data like share got this responsibility to them okay you're gonna say look top air go synchronization garni cam top air go all those processes currently executing with the memory okay all the processes I'm sorry it's, someone is screaming outside okay so uh, when concurrent processes are running and they're sharing the same data and uh, we tell the concurrent processes look you guys have to be responsible for your own self you must find ways of synchronizing amongst yourself that is called software approaches okay uh, then we've got hardware approaches where you know hardware instructions are already there so we can use the hardware instructions to provide synchronization or we can use some other uh, programming constructs such as semaphores and monitors which all of which we will see uh, in the next uh, slides so first come let's see the software approaches uh, so there are two types uh, there is strict alteration and then we'll see the Decker's algorithm and then we'll see the Peterson's algorithm so all of these algorithms we are seeing for only two processes we are assuming that only two processes are concurrently executing the memory that are communicating with each other and sharing the same shared data so one of the mean your solutions we are assuming only do it process the sharing uh, are using the same shared data so cottage and your shared data sir and it does a process limit they compete got this okay so you compete got the previous class mom the area like a city inconsistent data on the bank example ma the two cities avoid gunny we are using software approaches support approaches when you go the processes themselves are responsible for this coordination or the synchronization so let's begin uh, first example of the software approach is called a strict alteration uh, about your program here the alikiti you know but you have to uh, you know learn it in one form or the other because these are questions that will come in the exam and um, the other examples in the net are uh, a little cumbersome a little, a little too long these are the smallest shortest cleanest versions that i could find so just um, you know just uh, don't be intimidated with all these uh, programming codes so the first software solution is the strict alteration alteration when go one after the other so one example i can give you of strict alteration is when you do match pass left right left right left right after left comes right after right comes left so it's strict alteration there is no break in the alteration one lay one gardena zero by one zero go badma one one go badma zero so if two processes are sharing the same data so strict alteration method ma ki unza bani process one ko first turn unza process one ko turn so kera process two lay share gartsa data process a process two day share gari saki pachi fere process one ko turn unza the one two one two one two gartsa there's a strict alteration how is this possible this is possible by using a, a shared variable called turn there is a shared variable called turn and this turn is an integer variable it can be zero or one zero how many process zero ko turn ho critical section execute garni one turn ko you turn value you turn variable ko uh, value one cha bani it is uh, process one ko turn execute garni critical section the turn ko value zero cha bani it is process zero ko turn to execute now let us have a look this is what a uh, structure of this basic code segment would look like for a true process alteration uh, in simple c okay so uh, your process zero ko your code you know and your process one ko now let's see so turn ko value zero open a process zero so this is process zero so this is process zero remember this is process zero and I, i'm sorry i didn't write it here so this is process zero and this is process one okay so your process one ko critical section ho, right and is program is kamathim sapai program 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 says kamunim sapai program 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 so that this part of the part this part of the code in this program uh, share uh, shares the uh, uh, has access to the shared data he writes or reads the shared data no? meaning code mother critical section china you know the uh, inconsistent data but only probability china the critical sections and when the already entry section on the body critical section soccer exit section which we discussed in the previous example yeah 
you know, before you enter the critical section, you must do something. Say, look, I want to go into the critical section. You must set an alarm. Then you go into the critical section. Once you end exit, and again, you set off the alarm. So likewise, there is a, whenever a process wants to go into the critical section, he has some code that will do the work of the entry section. And after he finishes the critical section, he's got some code that will do the work of the exit section. Similarly, in process uh, one also, same thing, entry section and exit section, critical section, remaining code, right? So process one, when he wants to go inside, he has a while loop and he checks. So process one, eh, sorry, process zero, kai le critical section jano saksa, taba jaba turn ka value zero cha. So what is he checking here? He's checking is turn, another thing for the people who are not very well with programming, yo a while loop ho, while loop chali basa, as long as this parameter is true. So even a while loop, C ko. In a C language ma, this, as long as this while is true, this while loop keeps on going on, when and as and when this parameter becomes false, this while loop breaks and he comes out of the while loop and then he goes to the critical section. So, your program zero run huda, your while loop run bhai basya bani, ee aur ki basya program. Jabha saman yo false huda hi na. The moment this becomes false, then they go to the next line. Okay. So, he comes first and he checks. Turn, turn zero cha ki chai na. So, say for example, turn is zero. Fine. So, turn is zero bani, yo process kai turn ho. Turn ko value 0 ya 1 hunu saksa. So let's just take turn ko 0, turn ko value 0 chare. So process 0 wants to go into its critical section. First thing, first thing he does is checks. Turn, turn ko value 0 chaki chai na. So he says turn not equal to 0. It is, it is false. And turn is not equal to 0. And turn is equal to 0. So turn is not equal to 0. This becomes false. So if this becomes false, it will not enter this while loop. If it does not enter this while loop, that means process 0 ko critical section will be executed. So when, when turn is zero, this will return false because turn is not equal to zero. Turn is equal turn is not equal to uh, turn not equal to zero is false. It is equal to zero. So it will it will not go inside this while loop. It will go into the critical section, and it will it will run its critical section. After it finishes finishes its critical section, it will set turn equals to one. Means our turn p one ko turn ayo banera. Will turn la one banana dinsa. Will auru afno ra auru ubre ko code run garsa. Our process one go maun structure to process one process one wants to go inside this critical section i leave a cut process zero late turn equals to one banaidio the turn process one ko cha the uli check garsa is turn not equal to one you're not equal to one though it is equal to one so you're false on sir you're false on the open if critical section ma zansa and uli your critical section so kira will if it turn equal to zero money in the usko turn my process zero light turn in the and only after remaining code so what did, what did we see process 0 it depends upon the value of turn turn 0 when process 0 turn 1 some process 1 zansa. fine so mutual exclusion is there now bounded with unse unse. And our turn 0 forever turn 0 1 unse unse. the kunai process forever wait pani gardaina you time kinabha you code run back up again Turn the one kaili na kaili unsa only critical section saksa saksa one unsa unsa yam critical section saksa saksa turn zero unsa unsa. So mutual exclusion pani bayo. Mutual exclusion means ulle run garda ulle paaye na. Because turn zero unda ulle mat run garsa ulle paunte na. Turn one unda ulle mat garsa ulle garda na. Bounded wait pani bayo. Ek jana process forever wait karna pade na. No progress. Now let's see why there is a there is this red highlight in no progress. So there is no progress means what? So let's let's just see. Turn equal to zero. When turn equals to zero, he does not go inside here. Acha, we didn't discuss. Agar turn equals to one, kya unsa? One sa. Who after critical section was solved? Sa. When turn equals to one, who critical section was solved? Sa. Ulla apni critical section mein jana pare. So P zero wants to go inside the critical section. Turn equals to one, so he'll check. Is turn not equal to zero? Turn not equal to zero. Turn is one, so is turn not equal to zero? Bane ko true bhaiyo. Turn the zero to hoy na. So, we will say turn 0 and turn 0 is not so true. Bhaiyo. So, while, while true bandha, it does nothing, do nothing, bandha, e gumi vasa. while, 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 Ule, you have to sock, sir. turn zero on a dinsa. You while look me racks, turn go value check. Racks is keeping on checking the turn value. As soon as process one makes the turn value zero, he says, Oh, turn is zero. Then he goes false, then he enters his critical section. So that way, mutual exclusion is there. 
but the but the important thing that I want to tell you now is imagine the scenario where process one wants to enter its critical section. He looks at the value of turn. Turn is zero. So if turn is zero, this becomes false. He comes directly to. He doesn't go into this while loop because turn is zero. It's his turn. He comes to his critical section. Then after he finishes the critical section, he turns the value one, and he gives the turn to process P one, and then he starts running his code. Now say this process zero is running his code. He's not his critical section. He's in a he's in that part of his program that you know doesn't matter much. It is not going to cause some synchronization problem. तरह याद करने पर निकली हो कि उल्लेख आपने क्रिटिकल सेक्शन सॉक्यू और ने उल्लेख टर्न का वैल्यू वन बनाई दियो सो दैट प्रोसेस पी वन कैन टेक इट्स टर्न नाउ फॉर एग्जांपल से प्रोसेस पी वन नीड्स टू गो इनटू क्रिटिकल सेक्शन टर्न तो उसका ही हो तब उल्लेख यह यह ऐसा सेंस इट सेस टर्न दिस बिकम्स फॉल्स P0 उसको यो कोड में ही था, remaining कोड से 500 lines of कोड सारे वो ये रिकॉर्डे रन कर दी था, इनपुट आउटपुट हो दी था। तो इतनी बेला समान, तीती बेला यो सब पे हो दी था, उन्हें यह टर्न वन उनसा, टर्न वन नो ना, दिस इज़ फ़ॉल्स, इट्स हिस टर्न, ही गोज़ इन दिस क्रिटिकल सेक्शन, अन्य बोले आपो उसको you know, the remaining code is in the process P1 is in the remaining code, the process P0 is in the remaining code, the process P1 is in the remaining code. Suddenly we realize that process P1 has finished his remaining code and again he wants to enter the critical section. So he wants to again enter the critical section but remember, he has a turn equal to 0. Turn is P0 is in the remaining code. So he has a turn, he checks, is turn not equal to 1? It is not equal to 1, it is 0, so this is true. So when this is true, this while loop keeps running and he keeps doing nothing. Now he wants to enter his critical section, but he is doing nothing. Why? Because turn is 0. So turn is 0 means it's P0's turn. P0 is not doing his critical section, P0 is doing his non-critical section. So there is no progress. You know, P0 critical section ma na huda pani. वो remaining code उल्लेख remaining code execute करता है बने उल्लेख यो P one को chance दिए का चाहिए ना मो critical section जान सो नहीं बंदा हाँ दी दही ना वही ना because there is strict alteration so progress बहुत है ना ये उड़ाले आर को को block कर देते हैं so this doesn't become a very good solution so there is a pictorial depiction of strict alteration you can see there is if turn is zero process if turn is i is zero then process P I को turn off, zero को turn off, critical section चलाऊं ने, अपनो critical section चलाऊं ने या turn J हो बने, turn equals one हो बने, process one को turn off चलाऊं ने, and then this has mutual exclusion, bounding weight, and no progress. Okay, so then then came so for your exams you will have to explain these and you will have to write these small codes of implementation program code segment, right? So then we come to the next one, is the Decker's algorithm. Now Decker was a, a mathematician and in it is it is here in 1962. He, uh, people claim that this is one of the first algorithms for full, first, you know, fully um, efficient, efficient, the uh, one fully complete algorithm for synchronization of software approach. The software approach is fully functional. Um, अल्गोरिदम बना खोजी ये देख कर ले वो ही 1962 बिकॉज़ तब रिस्ट्रिक्ट अल्टरेशन में ये भी ने प्रोग्रेस चाहिए ना या सो नाउ इन दिस ही अप्रोच ही सेड लुक वी गोन हैव टू वेरिएबल्स वेरिएबल दैट गोन बी एन इंटीजर वेरिएबल दैट इस गोन हैव जीरो और वन है ना जीरो था बने प्रोसेस वन जीरो वन सेवन प्रोसेस जीरो सेवन प्रोसेस जीरो वन सेवन प्रोसेस वन एंड दिस कॉल्ड तू कैन बी अ बुलियन फ्लैग बुलियन फ्लैग इज एन एरे है ना बुलियन फ्लैग इज एन एरे सो बुलियन फ्लैग जीरो बने को प्रोसेस वन को फ्लैग हो प्रोसेस फ्लैग वन बने को प्रोसेस टू को फ्लैग हो सो प्रोसेस फ्लैग जीरो पनी ट्रू या फॉल्स वैल्यू मतलब लें Say for example, this numbering is from one, so one and two, you know, zero, one, two, one, you know, one and two, you know. So flag zero can is set to false, and flag one is also set to false, which means flag zero, when the process zero, pani critical section of jahan aile jahan dina bande sa flag one pani aile critical section of jahan dina bande. So what is the difference between strict alteration and this Decker's algorithm? Decker's algorithm, there is no strict alteration. First you, then me, then you, then me. This to zaina. Ani yahan se option bande ko sa. If 
process zero wants to go into its critical section, usle afno flag. Flag zero like ki banao true banao If flag, process one wants to go into its critical section, usle afno flag jinse flag one sir, they true banao So you've got a system of saying, look, voting kind of. Look, I want to go into my critical section, or I am going into my critical section. Okay, so this is kind of a trigger. This is kind of an alarm. Now let's see what happens. Um, first, um, whenever uh, say let's say P zero wants to go into the critical section. So this is P zero and this is P one. Okay, so left hand side is P zero, right hand side is P one. So P zero wants to go into its critical section. Then he puts his flag to true. Okay, when he puts his flag to true, the first thing he does is he checks. Okay, so he puts his flag to true. Then before entering his critical section, he checks. Process one, the critical section of China or any one And after that, will trigger gory alarm. I want to go into my critical section. He said, flag zero let true banana. More the critical section, Janda should be thrown on process zero. Le. Through Janda Banda Gadi, he's saying, he's checking. More the going, that I hope process one is not in his critical section. So if process one is in his critical section, he's going to check. Process one go flag. Flag one, true, Chaki China. True, open the bitter portion. And the process one go flag zero chile. Initially, we flag zero to process one. Zanu Zandina, the flag one mother true. Sa. So, this is false. Flag one go process one go flag is false. Flag one is false. So, he doesn't go into the while loop, he enters straight away into his critical section. And when he enters, in, because he's the only one who wants to go, flag is true. Flag zero is true. Flag one is not true. You know, process one doesn't want to go into the critical section. So, then once he goes into his critical section, only suppose critical section is occupied, he will exit. Gonna put exit. Gonna put na agari turn like one banana dinsa. One banana go. Do three more turn. Na ek eta banana dinsa. Na ola banana dinsa. And kya karta? Flag pani false karta. Mu abo jaanu chahadi na banana. Flag one banana go process zero. Flag zero ni process zero doesn't want to go into his critical section. Then he starts executing the remaining of his code. Fine. So similarly, flag two also uh, will do the same thing now what happens if flag one is true okay our flag one is true process one already was critical section was, huh honey process zero wants to go into its critical section okay process zero wants to enter its critical section yeah there are process one is already there so who already there one that one flag one already true sir and the flag one true sir so let's go let's see what happens so process one left flag zero like true but now sir let's check cars sir Process one already flag one true cha ki chai na true cha because flag one already inside the critical section cha ta u bithra hao cha la thikhe cha u ta u la bithra cha jaanu man cha ta ra turn usko ho ki hoi na bandha cha ok so it's like it's like it's like when you're doing exam and exams and then you want to go to the toilet and you say sir i want to go to the toilet so that's like saying flag zero equals to true ta peko yeah 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 you're telling sir sir i want to go to the toilet and at the same time there's another guy he's saying sir even i want to go to the toilet so his flag one is also good true so evada sir le lu jau bhanyo arko sir le lu jau bhanyo both of you go to the toilet now there's going to be a deadlock but after both of you are true true then you're checking the turn turn bhanyo kosko turn ko pahila ayo but pahila ayo unu pardai na tara abo yo exam mal ma ko pahila ayo and so he's checking a turn turn equal to equal to one turn ko value one chaki chai na bhanda sa and turn ko value turn ko value one Chaki sign a turn ko value one cha bani. Madlab turn ko on turn ko value one ho bani. Madlab process P one came first. So he will go to the toilet first. Or he will enter his critical section first. So turn one raisa bani. A turn one the P one ko pa raisa. I mean, do jaanli jaanu chanti ho. Even I wanted to go, I made true. Even he wanted to go, made true. Tera turn the usko raisa. So I will make my flag false. So will flag like false bani osa. Why na? So he goes back to his seat and he sits. And all the while he's keeping on checking. And the boss, the boss, you, that will check. Got it? Got it? While loop, my infinite loop, my turn zero, sir. A turn one, sir. One, sir. I'm K got it. Very boss, sir. Sir, my toilet answer not even, sir. You know, kind of in the exam time. And then saying, no, no, he's already there in the toilet. Then again, you sit down. So again and again, you're keeping on checking and checking. And finally, finally, at some point of time, you know, he, this guy, he leaves his critical section and he converts turn equal to zero. Turn equals zero got in and you while loop my eh, turn equals zero by sabansa, then he puts flag equals to true. You know? Flag true bonosa, then you if loop but a by round sir, very while my possa. Very while I'm very of Java some flag one true dina. Java some only flag puny one false bonosa. 
जब ये फ्लैग ऑन फॉल्स होने चाहिए फ्लैग ऑन ट्रू हो बंदा इन्हें फॉल्स हो बंदा ये वाइल्ड लूप पर एक्सिट कर सा देन पी जीरो कैन गेट एंटर इस क्रिटिकल सेक्शन सो दैट इस द वे दे दे एबल टू इनकॉर्पोरेट म्यूचुअल एक्सक्लूजन फॉर क्रिटिकल सेक्शंस वही ना अब I'm sorry if it's becoming a little complex, but just bear with me. Now let's see. Agita progress thi na. Yeh one P zero critical section ma na baaye pani. P one na janu theko thi na strict alteration. Now let us see this part. Will he stop? Uh, he say for example, he's already finished his critical section. Yeah, he goes inside. He goes. He, he goes to his critical section, he finishes his critical section, he makes turn equal to 1, so turn equal to 1 means he goes to turn equal to 1, then the flag equals to false, means he goes to critical section, so he goes to then he is in his remaining code, fine, now he goes inside, now this guy, remember this guy is in his remaining code, and turn is 1, and his flag is false, so he he goes inside, and he, he puts his flag is true, and he says flag 0, okay, process 1, you know, is it true? Process one, process zero. The process zero wants to go inside. He checks. Process zero doesn't want to go inside. It's false. So he will not go inside this while loop. He'll go inside the critical section. So he'll enter his critical section. Fine. Then he'll make turn equal to zero. So okay, now I'll give it to his turn. And he puts his flag one equals to false. He says I finish my critical section. He goes into his remaining code. Now at this time, what is the value of turn? Turn is zero, and his flag is false. Even his flag is false. He is in his remaining code. Process P1 is also in his remaining code. That is the current status of this environment. Now it so happens that process P0 is stuck in his remaining code because the input output is taking very long. And process P1, what he does is he again come, he needs to execute his critical section. So again he comes here, he makes his flag 1 equals to true. And he says, okay, uh, does process P0 want to go inside? No, process P0 is stuck in his remaining code. His flag is 0, so he doesn't want to go inside. Yeah, then he this becomes false and again he goes back to his critical section so he can execute his critical section and again he does all this again he comes to the remaining code so if you compare this with the strict alteration this guy is not blocking him in any way unlike here yeah, you know the p0 will always block him and there will be no progress at certain times in that particular situation where i talk the Decker's algorithm by now I am sure you are feeling is my god it's pretty complex and how do we do this all this in the program and this and that so then Peterson said look I know you know this guy's algorithm is really really complex so I have got a simpler version with a similar flavors so he used the same variables turn and boolean okay and um, this is um, in 1981 Peterson proposed this critical section problem because Decker's algorithm was little too complex. So here again in this, uh, uh, like in Decker's algorithm, Peterson's algorithm also, uh, he has achieved mutual exclusion, they've achieved uh, progress and they've achieved bounded weight. And just that Peter Peterson's algorithm is a little more simpler than Decker's algorithm. Here, if P0 wants to go into uh, his critical section, <laughs> he makes his flag true, fine, and then what he does is he makes turn equal to one. Turn equal to one, he gives he just assumes that look, mo bhi ta zanchu, tarah mo zan vanda gadi turn chance ulai diya chhu, you know? So turn ulai dio, turn one ulai dio, and we check garsa. Mo ulai din chhu, maile ta ulai di. Turn equal to one, maile ta di. Tarah u zan chance ki chance na, usko flag one true chha ki chhi na, okay? So what he's saying is. He process P0 wants to go inside his critical section, so he makes it true. But before he does anything, before he goes into his critical section, he says, Okay, more I will give my turn to him first because I'm his friend. So he's just he makes turn equal to one, so it's his turn. So he checks. My letter will turn then equals to one. So do, does he really want to go in? So how does he go want to go in? Until unless he doesn't say flag flag one equals to true. You know, he doesn't want to go in. So maybe his flag is false. So P0 let turn one banai dio, the flag one the false is. So you can see there is an AND operation. So here AND operation, when is it true? When this one is also true, this one is also true, the whole thing is true. If either one of them is false, then this is false. This is a simple AND operation. We must we all studied uh, different kinds of operators in C, C++. 
so there is and or not so this is a simple and operation and operation true kai le unche jab you first first comparison pani true unche second comparison pani true unche when both of them is true then only in that condition this whole thing becomes true you know either one is false and becomes false so i like scenario ma ke bhayo turn equals to 1 ule dio flag the false is so if one is also false it becomes false so while do false bhayo ne bhitra paste paste na so he goes into his critical section see so even though he he gave turn usko chance p1 le dio tara p1 janai chandaina kina usko flag 1 false hai cha tesa hunda le yo dui ta ko output ke huncha false and true is always giving false so while loop false bhane pachi while loop bhitra jandaina he p0 enters his critical section then he makes his flag is false means he after he finishes the critical section he makes his flag his own flag as false that he is not in his critical section and he goes into his remaining code same thing if both of them want to enter his critical section at the same time then who decides the turn decides you know who goes into when if it is turn 0 then p1 will go inside p0 will go inside and turn will make his flag to false okay otherwise vice versa and uh, progress ko me hirde progress ko hirde say he goes inside his critical section and he makes his flag false fine ulle bhakka turn lai one banako thyo turn lai one banayera pani flag one mo jadina bhanyo haina usko false thyo to critical section ma goyo flag also one now remember turn equals to one and flag zero is false and he is in his remaining code process zero has turned turn equals to one and he's finished the critical section and he's made after he's finished his critical section he's turned flag zero equals to false and he is in his remaining code now p1 wants to go in he makes flag goes to 1 now he turns turn equals to 0 now you must remember i like scenario ma turn ko value ke cha 0 cha hai na p1 ka cha p0 ka cha remaining code ma cha flag 0 ko false cha turn ko value aile bhakar ule turn 0 banai dio 1 thyo wo 0 banai dio then he checks while flag 0 is true flag 0 is true okay hai na flag 0 true and flag 0 false ho to ewada ma false bhaye bhane while loop false hunchha while loop bhitra jadaina so he goes inside critical section fine then he finishes the critical section he makes his flag false and he goes into his remaining code now at this current scenario what is the status of this program of this environment is p0 is in his remaining code flag 0 is false uh, turn is value 0 because he just went in and uh, flag 1 is also false flag 0 is false flag 1 is false and he is also in his remaining condition both are in the remaining code now it may so happen that p0 gets stuck in the remaining code for some input output and he wants to go into the critical section again so usko false the only if it true banao cha that's perfectly fine then it turn 0 nahi the only if it 0 nahi banao cha then he checks is flag 0 true and turn is also 0 so turn equals to 0 this is true but flag equals to 0 flag equals to 0 is false Here is false, so this becomes false. So false and true will give you a false value. So this while is not executed, he comes into his critical section. So P zero does not block the progress of P one, unlike strict alteration. Now, uh, so one thing I want to tell you is all of these three things had something in common. If you can see, strict alteration had this while loop. kept on checking for the turn value turn value he also kept on checking when the turn is going to be 0 and 1 when the turn is going to be 0 and 1 even in decker's algorithm yeah, there is a while loop that keeps checking the turn there is a while loop that keeps checking the flag and they keep checking they keep checking an infinite loop if you see the peterson's algorithm also he kept checking this is flag 0 and turn 0 he kept checking is flag 1 and turn 1 if it is true then do nothing you know if flag is also 1 and turn is also 1 that means it's not p0's turn is p1 stud so he p1 is doing his critical section so he keeps doing nothing and he keeps checking for one of these values to be false so when you are keeping on checking this variable or the value of these variables you know in a infinite for loop kind of a manner then this is called busy waiting so this is called busy waiting so we don't want a solution that has busy waiting so somewhere you can see you know, all of the software approaches does have busy waiting and busy waiting will somehow decrease the performance of a computer because you're wasting unnecessary resources and performance by keeping on checking for some event to happen so there are again many other software approaches but um, we will not do um, more of them so we'll straight away come to the next uh, you know group of approaches called 
hardware approaches these also called synchronization hardware Uh, so software approaches when you processor off my jojo involves a owner of a some kind of synchronization got about you know logical errors there are unus aksa software ma you know any risk of logical errors and there is a very high processing overhead because of this busy waiting to you know variable a check got it got it so okay let's have a hardware solution so hardware solution there are many kinds to we are going to talk about disabling interrupts and test and set instructions so disabling interrupts when you kill if you go back to my previous uh, you know a long time ago when we started the operating system classes we said that a process can be in many transition states ready running waiting you know like even in scheduling you know preemptive and non-preemptive preemptive preemptive if a process has the cpu if a higher priority process or a shorter job process comes then the two process just come cpu sir he's preempted अनि त्यो प्रोसेस जसको सीपीयू थियो उसको खोज्दिन छ त्यो प्रोसेसलाई वेटिंग बनाउँछ अनि त्यो सीपीयू नयाँ प्रोसेसलाई दिन्छ दैट्स कॉल्ड प्रीएम प्रीएम्प्टिव प्रोसेस थियो हैन त हाउ वाज दिस पोसिबल दिस वाज पोसिबल बिकज इट वाज इंटरप्ट्स हैन सो त्यो सिनारियो थियो सन्दर्भमा अहिलेको हो त व्हेन वन प्रोसेस व्हेन वन प्रोसेस इज इन इट्स क्रिटिकल सेक्शन प्रब्लम हुने ठाउँको कोड चलाइरहेको छ अरु आएर इन्टरफेयर गर्नु भएन हैन सो दैट मीन्स ही क्यान बी प्रीएम्प्टेड उसको बडा the process lanum by na koi aera us uli chalaun the gari data critical section ma chalaun the gari data us ko bada chinyera arka la dinu bai na you know you cannot be preempted so one way of doing it is when it is this critical section operating system the, the processor oh, disables all interrupts suppose inter, uh, uh, process after the critical section with the post ta suppose interrupt disable gari bani kasirin disturb gari pae na ta you know so this is gari da you know Crucial exclusion once so this is not a very sound solution because multiprocessor system single processor system or multiprocessor system um to evda evda cpu see the unsa and you will critical section post on the agari will processor la bansa and the opening system day yes processor please don't entertain any interrupts bansa you don't entertain any interrupts or don't snatch away this you know this uh, this critical section from the, because some other high priority processes come on era only two processor at the bonds any the multi-processor system or processes when the top so this two message separate really and it's up to acknowledgement on the there is some delay and if you factor in this delay then the then the process can enter its critical section all the news is gone to all the processors saying look process p1 wants to enter its critical section so disable all interrupts so CPU utilization alikati efficiency alikati problematic unza and arko kuru scheduling scheduling ko purpose ke thiya amro if you remember the last unit scheduling ko purpose ke thiya bani there are certain processes whose priority is very high there are certain processes uh, who may starve starvation bani thiyo there are certain processes uh, conveyor effect hun thiyo certain processes usko job siyano cha parkhe ko parkhe ka cha starvation bai sakyo so this is kata preempt ganna jaruri unza so uh, you approach the disabling interrupts the you approach the scheduling algorithm ko objective or are you know preempt it on a second any multiprocessor ma alikati utilization problem by you so there is uh, instead of disabling all interrupts why don't we have another um, sorry my house construction company what is so there's a lot of noise okay so um, the another another example of hardware uh, solution would be a test and set instructions the certain instructions are inbuilt into the hardware you know, it doesn't have to be implemented at, uh, with this uh, code but um, the logic is the same and moreover there's only a structure of the code so test and set instruction when you go to hardware instructions huh? just let's say um, Test and state instruction is a key or something. It is atomic. One very important thing is it's atomic means test and state instruction is atomic. But you can test and state of a multiprocessor system. Ever a process lay test and set the library until unless this test and set doesn't finish. Arco processor lay test and set the long sardina only, only after this first processor finishes his test and set, then the other process can start. So, uh, so it's it's like one at a time. So, test and set line mutual exclusion. Gonna sucks. I'm the test and set here we can we can uh, have a solution of forming mutual exclusion for the critical section so kasari hunda ra sabhane yo test and set ma hamle euta binary lock lock is a boolean lock one or zero hune true or false hune 
you know, lock like pass gun over so critical section of post on the agari, your test in set like lock your lock variable like say test in set function manuna, your test in set function ma pot on over okay. So lock is a variable that is shared between two concurrent processes P1 and P2. Okay, so let's see here. Uh, this is the structure of the test in set. Test in set instruction cost the dexter is the dexter. So it's a boolean, boolean money, it returns true or false. So, and what is it checking? It's checking lock. So, lock come down this one. process critical section post to port. So, your test in set function put on so only lock variable put on so lock variable is shared between process 0 and process 1. Okay, or the concurrent processes. So, the lock will put on so you lock check or set test in set. Test money got this a test got a set got the key got the layer if lock the lock lock true saki china is checking you know so if lock when you go is the lock true or false the lock lock savani key return gun over return lock when you go lock if the lock is true when you go tala lagi go sorry key return gun over return lock yes tala lagi go sorry return gun over Check got this in the first. Check got the key. Tala lag at all. Like a top. When you get it in Gonone, yes, Tala lag at all. Good. Agar Tala lag at China. When you get it in Gonore, Tala lag at lock. Lies in Oripila. And the returns a key Gonore. I know Tala lag at Tina. When again, again, I'm saying test and lace set licky because it lock like test cursory. And he said, Nigursary that lock Matala lag at Savani. Lock Matala lag at Savani. K return got sorry lock they lock let lock is true you know lock is true if lock true true it's how many key gonna turn if what I didn't know lock matala like it's a lock matala like it's a new please return yes true lock matala like it's a lock matala like it's a china bunny you know then lock matala like it's a china bunny key return gonna worry uh -huh, like it's a china one with a hurry let us go to process P0. Now, process P0 wants to enter his critical section. So, before he wants to enter his critical section, he will call the test and set function and he'll pass the value of lock. Is that fine? Okay. Now, say uh, the lock is 0. Fine. If the lock is 0, then what happens? He, she, the process P0 set sends the lock value to test and set function and the it comes here lock is zero false fine right? if lock is false it's open then return lock he enters the critical section then he makes lock false again okay again he goes so lock is what false again again he must enters critical section again he sends lock he goes here lock lock false sir and lock so if lock Lock true saki china. I know lock the false sa lock full lacha lock full lacha many else mouth else mouth the kicker sa lock like true but I didn't say lock like true banaka current kune or process le lock like test got this a one a a wule ki dexa lock is true dexa and he return ki gotsa return false gotsa yeah return false answer yeah false on the while loop false with the post and I go straight with the critical section again process p0 le critical section sucks sa again he makes the lock false any other process wants to go into its critical section the lock is false now you know again he if there is a new process he wants to go into his critical section he will send the lock to the test and set the lock is false the lock is false he will not go into the if loop you know he'll go into the else loop he'll make lock true and return false lock true sir you know false on sir yeah false but why yeah false back chance why you know you have to return return on the function of bullock here the return key on the false on the yeah, false on the while false when he with the he will go inside his critical section when he's inside his critical section all the while lock is true lock is true so lock is true when you see nobody else can come inside someone else wants to do test and set in lock it will return true so they will not go inside another process that wants to try and go inside the critical section when this guy is already there key on the also for look while look going to go inside so this is another example of synchronization but through hardware now finally we'll talk about semaphores uh, and um, your test and set previous code put variations you know, and we don't want to cover any more of it 
So the next solution is a semaphore solution. Semaphore was proposed by Dijkstra's. Uh, this is kind of a programming construct, you know, like an operating system provided construct. Uh, so, uh, integer data type unza, list data type unza, lists are uh, abstract data types, structured unza, queues unza. So this take halke semaphores bande bani or abstract data type was proposed by person called Dijkstra's in 1965. Now, this is the photo of Mr. Dijkstra's. Uh, Dijkstra's is famous for shortest path. You must know his algorithm is still used today in many analysis, especially spatial analysis, where when it comes to network uh, trajectory data, networks means. Mm, stream data, road data, spatial data, asma, and trajectory means person go cell phone entry and exit. Jab hum udhar se aata hai, track karta hai. Usko shortest path I lim chala usar. So usko arko, na arko research I lim chala, I lim na chala hai bani. Very prevalent kuch jo thee bani semaphore so is operating system. But the shortest path he is also called semaphore. So semaphore kyo? It is a a data type. An abstract data type, you know, and it is represented by uh, data type semaphore, like integer, like float, like those are primitives, but uh, abstract like list queues, you know, so semaphore S, sorry, you know, and it can be initialized to certain va variable. Okay, the variable can be binary or it can be counting. So binary means S that semaphore that is only zero and one, or counting means it can have many values. Fine. The uh, just wait let me just see where is the semaphore okay fine so uh, before we uh, so i think you'll understand this better okay because uh, you know slide math they say dictate what is happening you know? so you have to go dive in so semaphore cost to take the rest of the semaphore take those is okay so semaphore so semaphore ma see यो सिमा फॉर्म है व्हाट आई वांटेड टू रियली नॉट डू इज या सो आई वाज मिसिंग अ प्रो लाइन ऑफ कोड या ओके अब ले यो एरिया बने सिमा फॉर्म जस्ट जस्ट गिव मी अ गिव मी बेर सिमा फॉर्म है एस कैन हैव अ वैल्यू ऑफ वन एंड जीरो ना वन बने को यू कैन गो इन जीरो बने को यू कैन गो इन so whenever a process wants to go into his critical section, he has to wait on the semaphore and then after he enters the critical section, he must signal the semaphore. So see for example, S is 1. If S is 1 and process wants to go inside, so he will wait on the semaphore. So when he waits on the semaphore, this wait will run, semaphore wait will run, wait S on sir. So S mile is 1 sir. So while S is less than equal to 1, you see, S 0 or 0 is less than equal to 1. ही ना करने रहे ये ही लोग में बस ये बस नो जो जीरो था बने क्रिटिकल सेक्शन जाने दी जाए ना फाइन सो आई लिखे चाहे एस इज वन था इज एस लेस देन इक्वल टू जीरो फॉल्स सो इट नॉट गो इनसाइड इस फॉर लूप इल 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 नॉट गो इनसाइड इस वाइल्ड लूप इल कम आउटसाइड इस वाइल्ड लूप एंड व्हाट हैपन Fine. Once it goes into its critical section, then it will again signal S. Once it signals S, means it will come, come here. And again, I will S 0 by you, minus minus 0 by you, so plus plus garsa, 1 garsa. So, bani pachi, a process can enter its, crit its critical section if the S, if you wait on the semaphore S and S is 1. Fine. And S, uh, S is 1. Yeah. S is 1. And you enter the critical section. Zero unsa, very signal pukda na pukda one unsa. So it keeps rotating that way. So uh, if you still have problems, um, I will take this class again. Otherwise.